on two of what I got today. Um, for 50 cents a piece, I got like a shitload of records. And it's all stuff like Janis Joplin, The Doors, uh, The Clash, Rolling Stones, uh, more Janis Joplin, Bowie, Van Halen, Dick, uh, Led Zeppelin, uh, The Beatles, uh, Patti Smythe, Led Zeppelin. As you can see, just a great selection of records. I didn't even check them. <laughs> see more who. Uh, but those I'll be able to sell anywhere from three to five. And then what doesn't sell, I'll just dump. Um, got some DVDs. I'll, sh I'll show these because I have a friend that likes to see. Hairspray, Harry Potter, Knocked Up, uh, Dave Matthews Band. I can sell these sometimes. X2 for a little bit more. I'm in a rush today. Uh, Fiddler on the Roof. Oh, that's a good movie. Uh, Better Off Dead. Classic 80s movie. Rumble Fish. Look at all the stars in that one. Um, greatest Classic Hits. Dirty Dancing. The original uh, Juno. Uh, here's a 15 in 1 movie pack. Uh, Zelig. Goonies. Sealed. That's probably not a big deal. Here's a 20. Albert Hitchcock. And I think we paid 5 for this. I think we paid like less than a dollar or a dollar. Roger and Hammerstein's collection. Then, uh... No, oh, this is more of the records. I got some 45s, and they're like uh, Rolling Stones and Beatles, loose stuff. Um, there's a Yoko Oko with the sleeves. Sometimes the sleeves are worth more than the actual records because they're harder to come by. Uh, let's see. Just more CDs. Heathers, uh, The Apartment, uh, A Life, Labyrinth, Willow, and Casablanca. Okay, that's where I got. Uh, for $5 at Warren Sale, I got this. It's a John Deere, pretty decent looking truck. Uh, it's made by uh, Ertl. I don't know what it's worth, but it's worth more than five. I don't know how much it's, how complete it is. Whatever. Bought a lot of CDs today, and then um, I got these. These are like uh, I think they're DVD sets, and uh, they're museum stuff. Let me see if I can see on this side. Ancient Greek civilization, a history of impressionism, history of European art, history of European. Just DVD sets. Uh, got a lot of CDs, mostly classical, some pop and rock. CDs were in the t 25 to 50 cent mostly, and then some I paid a dollar for. 20 bucks. Uh, also, for like a few dollars, I got all these art books. Uh, well, this actually I bought the other day. I forgot to show it. Let me stick that over here. Uh, how to paint landscapes. Uh, how to paint buildings. And then I got, this is like, there's a, a Picasso modern art. Really big book. El uh, Greco to Picasso. That's like a summary. And then there's a big, fat, thick modern painting and silk sculpture book that I got. And I only paid like, I think $2 for all of these. A, a great, great bunch of books. For $20 at another sale. Got all this Barbie stuff. This is pretty cool. It's a Barbie and uh, Skipper electric drawing set. Uh, it's in there. You know, I don't need to show it to you. It's either complete or mostly complete. Then I got a... Part of the 20 was I got like... Uh, just Barbies. There's, these aren't really old ones. They're probably from the 70s and 80s. Not really too valuable, but at five bucks a box, basically, I can sell these. I, I might be able to fish out some parts. That'll be worth a little bit more. Um, you know, sometimes uh, one thing can be worth a lot, but as you can see, it's just it's just Barbie stuff. Um, probably most of it isn't worth very much. I'll probably wind up selling these boxes in the, uh, I don't know, maybe maybe 15 to 25 and there's some more dolls and, and just clothes and stuff uh, not nothing great I don't think um, let's see I mean look what they did to this guy's here just just Barbie stuff but yeah that covers uh, the Barbies and the other uh, CDs and DVDs that I got and uh, one more video of just collectibles